so we want to start painting our models and we want to start with a basic material that does not have this specular that we have right here that does not have any glossiness any condensants anything no bump no normals nothing we want a default material and as you can see mudbox default material has a lot of specularity specularity in computer graphics terms represents the amount of reflectivity a surface has and you will hear things like brightness or specular highlights or even shininess but it has to do with the highlights primarily in our materials and as you can see in mud bugs our material is pretty shiny so what we want to do is we want to create a generic material so what I'm going to do is I'm going to select my default gray and even the default grade has some form of specularity. Now, there's two ways that we can modify the specularity. One, we can go to this material right here and we can click on the specularity and we can select black. And as you can see, now we have no specularity whatsoever. And the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go to this button right here and we're gonna go to add material preset and we're gonna call this one gray no spec and you will notice on the right hand side we have this new material and now we can start creating our own specularity maps we're going to do the same thing for our glossiness and for our incandescence now the second way of modifying this material is going over the object go to right mouse button and go to edit material and you will notice that this is the same setup as what we have right here. So I'm gonna go to my gloss and I'm gonna select black and hit okay. And then I'm gonna go to my incandescent and I'm gonna select black. I'm gonna hit okay. And the main reason why we're doing this is because we wanna create the specular, the glossiness and the incandescence map. And the bump, normal, reflection mask, opacity, and then the rest of our attributes, we're gonna leave them the way that they are. Again, as soon as you have the material created, you are gonna go right here to the material presets, go to the options and create a new material preset. <laughs> 